this is how I deal with plugging a tire where the hold on the plug is bigger than what's designed to for these plugs and the reason the hole is too big is because there were two holes right together I plugged one with one plug uh, inflated it still air was coming out that's how I figured there was two holes because this tire was probably run over um, uh, an area that had multiple uh, nails or uh, staples whatever it is so you get multiple holes right close together so the the way I deal with it is I put two plugs in the hole and that's my plug um, tool and I take two of those black strips right there two plugs and put them in there now um, when you put them in there it's going to have a tendency to want to come out under the, uh, the pressure of the air in the tire but also when you're turning the wheels and it's going across the, the road is going to be trying to pull it out of there scrape it out of there so my solution is, um, after I put the plugs in there, I'm going to loop that cable tie right there in between the stuff that stuck out. There's one plug right there. It sits in there really good because it's per the design of this this plug. When you push, when you push the plug through the hole in the tire, it'll, it'll expand and if it's the right hole diameter, uh, then this plug is designed to stay in place. But this hole is too big, so I'm putting two in there, and I'm going to stabilize it with the black ties. This is part one. I'm going to show you the resulting view of it on part two.